So this is the continuation in the video on John Stewart's Calculus Early Transcendentals 8th edition. Uh, this problem is fairly simple. There's not really too much to say about it. It's asking for the domain and range. And to start with, the domain is basically how far the function travels on the x-axis. And we can see it starts at about negative 2 and goes to positive 2. So the domain is simply negative 2 to positive 2. And the range, we can see the lowest point on the graph appears to be negative 1, as far as the y-axis goes. And the highest point on the graph is 2. So the range of the function is from negative 1 to 2. And that's fairly self-explanatory. As far as if it's a function of x, it appears to be, because we don't see any place where the vertical line test fails. I just drew a bunch of lines as an example here on the graph and if you follow the curve you'll see there's no point where the curve crosses the same line twice. If we did we could say it's not a function of x but right now it only crosses once. It's smooth, there's no jumps, no discontinuity so yes it's definitely a function.